Hey, what's going on, guys? Jake the Happy Snake here, and welcome to episode 6 of Pokemon Ruby Second Chance. Last time I left Rustboro City, I saved Mr. Briny's Pico from the Team Aqua member, and then I met the, uh, the president of the Devon Corporation, Mr. Stone, and then I got a ride from Mr. Briny here to Deuford, and this time I'm going to be taking on the second gym, but before I do that, I actually need to make my way through the Granite Cave, talk to this guy. And he gives us an HM for Flash, but we can't use it yet because we need to do for Gym Badge. And I could wait to do this until after I get the Gym Badge, but I've gone through this cave so many times without using Flash, I don't need it. So, yeah. So we're here, we have an escape rope, so that'll be nice. Another wild Pokemon, an Aeron. In Sapphire and Emerald, you can find Wild Sableyes in here, which is definitely a good choice for a team member, because it doesn't have a weakness, or at least in this version, it doesn't have a weakness. But you will not find one of those in Ruby. And here you get an Everstone, which is definitely useful if you don't want to evolve your Pokemon. Oh my goodness, enough with the wi- Ooh, a Mawile! Yeah, you find a Mawile's in here instead of Sableyes. Or instead of Sableye, I should say. Alrighty! Oh my goodness. I go like two inches and then I find another wild Pokemon. Like, seriously, enough. Alright, here's the guy we want to look for. This is the, uh, Steven, that device you have there? It's a Pokenav. Yes. Oh, pardon me, my name is Steven. I'm inter interested in Rush Stone, so I travel here, here and there. Oh, a letter for me? Okay, thank you. You went through all this trouble to deliver that I needed, thank you. Let me see, I'll give you this TM. I can name my favorite move, Steelwing. Which, normally I don't find useful, but I have a Tailo. Actually, I guess that is useful for me most of the time because I quite often when I play through a, a Hoenn game, I have a Talo on my team. So, yeah, I'm actually okay with that. Really, it's only useful to you if you have a flying type on your team, and there's not too many flying types available at this point in the game. There's Talo, there's Wingle, uh, there might be another one that I'm missing, but right now those are the only two I can think of. So yeah, we're going to teach Steelwing to Falco. And I will get rid of Growl, because I don't need it. There we go. And I will use an escape rope. This is the escape rope that I found at the beginning of the Granite Cave to get out of here. And we'll go to chair feet up front. And now it is time to take on the second gym. The gap between the first two gyms is like nothing. Like between the first and the second gym, it, there, there, it's hard, there's hardly any gap at all. But between the second and third gym, the gap is a little bit bigger. All right. Don't you dare brush me off. It's not my fault if you cry. Wow. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready to go. Battle girl Laura. She has a meditate. By the way, I'm going to say this again. I said this like a couple episodes ago, I think. I'm going to say this again. I have not used a potion this entire Let's Play, and this is the sixth episode. So I'd like to keep it that way. We're going to Bullet Seed, because Bide is actually kind of a scary move. Hopefully this hits more than twice. Oh, yeah! And a quick attack will take care of you. I was very lucky to get that critical hit on the second Bullet Seed. There we go. Well, I lost. Wow. Okay. Now this gym, this gym's puzzle layout is slightly different to what, than what it is in Emerald, so I have to make sure because like Brawly's in, he's in a different position than like in Emerald, he's in the top left of the gym. In Ruby and Sapphire, he's in the top right. So I gotta, I gotta make sure that I am doing this correctly. Hadiki, he has a much chop. 
See, I'm not even using my flying type yet. I'm already destroying this gym. With <laughs> weak grass attacks. Oh, wait, never mind. That wasn't really destroying. Alright, let's use Bullet Seed again. Alright, let's use it again. Actually, mm, Absorb might have been a good idea. Oh well. There we go. My chop goes down. And there we go. Level 18 for Cherofita. Not enough power. Nope. You can cry chop all you want, but it's not enough power for my really good team. There's no need for Brawly to be involved. I'll crush you. All right. Whatever you say. <laughs> Tessa from the after movie the after movie series I have not seen any of those <laughs> uh, I think when does the third one come out actually it's soon isn't it? isn't it September or something and there's a fourth one coming out next year I think all right well this is not gonna be a problem go another metatite do you just have a bunch of metatites in your team all the same level all the same movesets okay and oh you have a chop okay I'll probably go with Absorb. Low kick. <laughs> doesn't look like do more damage to heavier the, the opponent. I mean, Cherifeed, I don't think, weigh, or Grovile doesn't weigh that much. All right, quick attack. There we go. Level 19 for Cherifita. But how? How can I lose so easily? Because I'm just that good. Alright, so Cherifita is three levels ahead of Falco again. Just like in the last episode. So we're going to go over to Falco. Uh, I think there's at least one more trainer. Uh, there might not be, actually. I don't really know. Um... Hmm, actually, there might only... That might be it for the trainers. There's gotta be one more. No. Wow, that's it. There's only three trainers in this gym, in this version? I think Emerald... Emerald's got a couple of double battles, though, in this gym, so... Okay, well, I'm gonna go heal, and I will see you guys in just a second. Okay. I've healed. And I'm ready to go. Ready to take on Brawly. I lost to him in my first Ruby Let's Play, but I don't intend to lose to him this time around. Here we go, Brawly. Let's go. I've been churning the rough waves of these parts, and I've grown tough in the pitch black cave. So you want to challenge me? Let me see what you're made of. Let's go. So this is Brawly, the second gym leader of the game, and in my opinion, the hardest gym leader in the game. He starts off with a level 17 Machop. So, I'm gonna go with Wing Attack. I could use Focus Energy, but I don't know. I, I, I don't usually use that strategy. He's going with Bulk Up. That's an annoying attack, or annoying move. It's not an attack. Raises attack and defense, so this Wing Attack probably won't knock him out. Or it will. Never mind. So, there we go. Brawly's first Pokemon is down already. And next up is his Makuhita, which is level 18 or. Yeah, 18. I think it might be 19 in Emerald. So, you're just going to go with Wing Attack again. And that does half as well. I was not expecting to do... And you're using Arm Thrust. If this hits five times... Okay, good. Wait a second. <laughs> oh, 
All right. <laughs> Wait a second. What? There's no way it was that easy. <laughs> that was so incredibly easy. <laughs> I don't think I've ever beaten him that easily before, even with a tail low. That was pathetic. But to be fair, he he does have a different battle style in Ruby and Sapphire that he does in Emerald. And I don't know if I've ever used a Talo in Ruby or Sapphire before. So, yeah, I don't think I have. So maybe that's why it seemed easier, because he's definitely tougher in Emerald. But still, that was so pathetically easy. All right, I am definitely okay with this. Wow. That was so easy. <laughs> and that's Bulk Up. I have no idea what I'm going to do. Which Pokemon I'm going to use it for. Simply because I don't have my... I don't really have my complete team thought out. I have most of it thought out, but... Wow, that was really easy. So we have two badges already. Which is pretty awesome. So how about we take a look at our second badge. No, this is not what I want. What am I doing? Check it out. So, six episodes six episodes in, and I have two gym badges. So this is going pretty well. I still have not used a potion at all, which is nice. So, guys, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Really appreciate it. And, guys, I will see you back here on Friday for episode seven. And, by the way, in my first Ruby Let's Play, this is where the series, like, after six episodes, the series was put on, uh, on a six-month hiatus. But it, I was so much earlier in the game, I didn't even have my first gym badge. And now I have two. So I'm definitely ahead... And this let's play than it was in my first one. Guys, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. And I will see you back here for episode 7. Peace out.